Hello friend. In today's video, we are going to explain practical part of event handling. Okay. After understanding this practical, you will uh, be more interested in this topic event handling because it is much more interactive than console based programs. Okay. Event based UI based programs are more important, more interesting than our console based program. So let's start. First example is mouse events demo. So as we have explained, this package is created mouse events demo. Class is also created. AWT package event package is imported. Okay. So as I have explained you in the theory part, every event handler should extend frame for the outer window uh, creation. Then it uh, this uh, this example is implementing two interfaces. First is mouse listener and second is mouse motion listener okay so all the methods that are included in these interfaces whichever you are implementing it is must for you to implement all of those methods okay and when you are using the adapter that is you are extending the adapter class it is not compulsory that you have to input or implement all the methods it is up to you whichever methods are uh, required by you they, those methods only you will be implementing okay so here we are implementing the interface. So it is must for us to implement all of the methods, including in this mouse listener and mouse motion listener interface. Message mouse x mouse uh, y coordinate are uh, created as a variable. Then mouse listener mouse motion listener is created added over the, here. And before window, we have added the window adapter class object. Okay, for GUI based AWT. Uh, AWT event handler do not include or do not operate when you are closing the window using close button. It is not explicitly closed. Uh, it will be not implicitly closed. You have to close it using system.exit. For that system.exit 0, you have to uh, create a class called my window adapter that, that implement the window listener interface. Okay. Uh, all this stuff I have already explained in the theory part. If you are not, if you have not understood this, you can go back and again revise so that you will understand it better. And when you will particularly and perfectly understand the theory part, the practical part is very much easier for you. And after understanding practical, it is more, more easier so that you can practice by your own. Okay. So mouse click event is implemented. Okay. Message is appended. Click receive. Then repaint is called. It will uh, tell the AWT to call the paint method. Mouse entered. Mouse X and Y coordinates are updated as 100 and 100. And at that 100 and 100, uh, your mouse entered is uh, message is displayed and you are calling the paint method using C paint. Okay, mouse exited. You are printing message mouse exited. Mouse button pressed. Get X and Y coordinates of this ME mouse event object and button down is placed uh, printed at that position x and y coordinate okay and then paint is called on mouse release here also using this object x and y coordinates are get and button release is called and mouse drag okay message start plus mouse at x coordinate plus y coordinate and paint method is called okay then mouse move uh, moving mouse at this one x coordinate i y coordinate and paint method is called and when you are uh, calling the paint method the actual message with the x and y coordinate that is the latest mouse x and mouse y variable values will be taken to uh, have the location x and y coordinate and at that particular location will you, uh, your message will be displayed how your message will be displayed this is the graphics object it is compulsory to have then d dot draw string message at x and y coordinate okay this is the graphics object dot draw string method and it is compulsory for all event handler in awt based events then we are creating the object of the class mouse events demo that is implementing mouse listener and mouse motion listener then outer window is created with the dimension 300 into 300. Title is mouse events demo set visibility as 2. And this is the my window adapter. Okay. 
is extends window adapter and on window closing only the closing method we have implemented the extra five to six methods are avoided okay silently ignored over here so now i can run this project in front of you okay this is the mouse events demo it is a title this is the minimize button maximize button and close button i am moving mouse over here okay my cursor is moving and x and y coordinate of this cursor are displayed okay then i am dragging star mouse at dragging mouse at 568 into 317 625 344 650 676 31 71 etc button release button down click receive i am clicking click receive on button pressed button release button release okay mouse button release button down button release button down okay so all this stuff i am again dragging the mouse pointer at again different location so if suppose here the location having coordinates 165 175 176 550 nine okay so this way this is the mouse events same okay you can go through this project once if you have not understood any topic or if you want to write it down in your book or you have to take a screenshot okay all this stuff same code that we have already implemented in the theory part the same project same program is here only in that we were seeing only practical on people only theory in ppt and here we are implementing the practical okay every time x and y coordinates are updated and at that particular location in the paint method x and y coordinates this message will be displayed okay this is the important thing you have to remember and you cannot directly paint more than once okay when awt is first open uh, sorry when it is first open gui window is first open paint will be called okay first time you are running the program Second time, when another window is covering the uh, GUI base window, that is your output, and again it is uncovered, that is minimized. Outer window is minimized. Okay, front window is minimized. For example, you are running this project now. Okay, so at this run time, this is the window. Okay, if suppose I am uh, opening any other window like Paint over here, Paint CD. Okay, so every time it is uh, covering the window and decovering again, it is again paint method. Calling the paint method. All other times you have to call the repaint, and this repaint will tell the AWT that you have to call the paint method. is the paint method it is compulsory and important method this is the main method public static void main okay and these three things are common in all the programs you are going to see in the practical part set size set title and set visibility is equal to two okay and this is the window adapter for the close one what is close This is close button. When I am calling this close, system dot exit will be called. Okay, and then it will close the window. Now I am closing this project, and the second project is simple key demo. Package simple. Key. Okay. Okay. This extends frame implements key listener. 
see state string is created. Add key listener and add window listener is overwrite. Key pressed method is implemented. Key state is key down on key release and key type. So there are three things. Three events will be generated when you are dealing with the key listener interface. Key pressed, key release and key type. Okay, when you are typing, the message will be appended with the character. Okay, included, provided your character is generated using the key. All the function keys like F1, F2, F3 are the special keys. Okay, those, so those will not generate any character. Only A to G and plus your 1 to 0 to 9 digit key will only generate the character. This is the paint method. String will be drawn. At this particular uh, message will be drawn at this particular x and y coordinates 20 and 100 and key state is uh, uh, displayed at this particular location x coordinate 20 and y coordinate 50 okay and in main method object of this class is created then set size set title set visibility is true okay dimension you can give any dimension as you need it is not compulsory that whatever i am providing you have to give the same you can provide any dimension okay so maximum dimension will be your uh, laptop screen dimension okay and this is the window closing now i can run this code this is a simple window created okay the so simple keys are this is simple key event I am pressing backspace, it is taking at the back, backspace uh, blocks. Okay, uh, one thing I will do, I will again run this. Hi, my name is Suvarna. Okay, I am explaining you simple key event demo by mistake it's printed as b okay okay so every time i'm pressing the key it is down and I, when i'm releasing now i'm releasing the enter key is showing me key up you can see over here you can see my cursor key down key up key down key up key down key down okay so you can go through this one Third choice is key events demo. So this will be uh, dealing with our special keys package key events demo is generated. Okay, so special keys are our function keys, key down, key up, arrow keys and etc. etc. All that keys that have the special uh, constants, integer constants created in the chart we have seen here. All these keys are special keys and those will be those can be given in this which case we are going to see right now okay so this is the key events demo sending frame implementing key listener key events demo is a parameterized constructor key listener is added window listener is also added and new my window adapter is passed as a parameter key pressed key state is key down okay so whenever I am pressing the key, 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 key code is get ke dot key code. So this is generated. Ke, ke is a key event generated. So here its code is uh, taken over here. Integer key. So this code as a constant will be passed to this switch case. Okay. So we can underscore F1, F2 key, F3 key, page down and then page up, left, right, etc, etc. All that stuff is included over here. Okay. And from a reprint is called key release, key up is printed, key type message will be appended 
okay so if you are pressing the simple key its key uh, message will be appended with the character and if you are pressing the special keys uh, its character will be like appended like message plus is equal to f1 okay so then in the public static void main uh, sorry in the paint method message is displayed at 2000 and key state is displayed as 20 into 50 this is the uh, object of the class created who is implementing the key listener interface okay and this is the window adapter now i will run this code hi my self Na. Okay. Now I am pressing the F4 key. F4 is not included. F1 is printed. Page up, page down. Right arrow, left arrow. Okay. F2 and F3 in my keyboard are not working, so this will not be displayed. Okay. I can do one thing. I can add more keys. Those are working, and in this my laptop. so that you will understand okay so i am adding f3 effect suppose effect then um, i don't know if this keys are working or not i'm just trying Let's see what happens. Hello. F four. F eight. F nine are working over here. F one is also working. Okay, so this way we have understood it. How it's working? Special keys, how they are working? So you can go through this code as usual. So I, now I will close this one. Next is adapter demo in which we can implement those methods only in which we are interested or the methods that are required by us. Only methods we will implement, not all methods. Okay, adapter demo extends frame. Add mouse listener, add mouse motion listener, new mouse adapter, new mouse adapter. Okay. and window adapter this is the main method here we are creating the object of the class adapter same so first is only mouse click and drag events here we are implementing my mouse adapter extends mouse adapter so only method we are implementing uh, first of all what we are going to give is uh, parameterized constructor parameter will be the object of the adapter demo class and what the adapter demo class is having mouse listener mouse motion listener and window listener okay so that will be handling the event okay mouse click message will be appended as mouse click adapter demo message and paint will be called adapter demo paint will be called since it is extending frame the outer window will be provided by that only then mouse drag mouse drag will be appended and paint will be called and this is the window adapter the explanation i have already done in the theory part if you are not able to understand you can go through this 
uh, in the theory part okay okay now five dragging the mouse and click on the mouse now again dragging again clicking okay this way the message is updated it is dragging it will be displayed as mouse drag so this click it will display mouse click okay every time repaint will be called and every time in main uh, sorry in paint what will be done g dot draw string message will be my new message that is blank message not it will be appended it will be over written okay so i am closing this one okay next is mouse press demo package mouse press demo is created okay it does not use the inner class without inner class this is extending frame message blank is created mouse press demo a uh, new mouse adapter is i like a previous example we are adding the adapter in the bracket as a parameter okay then paint method is called draw string created to draw string and my mouse adapter extends mouse adapter mouse press demo object is initialized like this this dot mouse press demo is equal to this object whatever we are passing as a parameter in the main method okay and handle the mouse on have mouse press mouse press will be like uh, over it and like this and paint method will be called okay and in the main method what we are doing uh, my mouse adapter every time new my mouse adapter is passed as an add add in in the add mouse listener okay every time listener will be added and when listener will be added new mouse adapter will be passed as a parameter okay so i will, now i can run this run this project as usual mouse press mouse press mouse press like this only mouse press is handled okay without the inner class you can go through this project it is extending frame like in the previous example So when we are passing it like like a new mouse adapter, this will be passed as a parameter, and this is what the frame. Okay, this is the frame that is the outer window. New mouse adapter, the parameter constructor is called, and this that is this class is passed as a parameter, and this is the frame that is outer window. Okay, and main message is this, and it is called repeat. Okay, this way this program is also finished now. Now we can go with this next one in our class demo. Here also package in our class demo is created. Okay, then here we take extend frame. these packages are imported like awt and even these are the important packages you have to remember then this extends frame in inner class demo new my mouse adapter is provided new window adapter is provided okay so mouse my adapter extends mouse adapter 
and uh, mouse press event is implemented over here and message is overwritten as mouse pressed okay all this stuff is same my window adapter and uh, your paint method and inner class our uh, demo object is created okay so what is different this is the class so So whatever you are writing over here, which is the inner class, is to handle the mouse based events. Okay. So whatever you are writing, it, it is it is inside your inner class. Okay. So this class can directly call the directly uh, can have variables inside this like this message is equal to mouse pressed so it can directly access the variables in the inner class demo okay so this is the main point in the inner class so whatever you are writing that will be writing written inside the is my mouse adapter is not outer class inside the inner class demo class so you can directly access this message is equal to mouse pressed. Okay. So again we will run this. It will handle the same output mouse pressed. Whenever I am clicking it will be creating mouse pressed event. Okay. So now you can go through this. This class is also written inside, not outside. Okay. The main is also written in the same class. So nothing is written outside like in the previous example. So you can directly access the variables and methods in that. Now, anonymous inner class demo is the last project of this event handling chapter. Okay, so this is also anonymous inner class demo. Here we are adding to handle uh, adding inner class to handle mouse based event. Add mouse listener is equal to new mouse adapter, and directly we are opening uh, having the opening and closing. Uh, curly braces explanation of this is already done in the theory part if you are not understanding here you can uh, again go back and check the explanation part okay so this is the parameterized uh, sorry default constructor of this class and here we are directly giving the anonymous inner class new mouse adapter so we are not creating adapter like in the previous class class mouse adapter extends uh, sorry class my mouse adapter extends mouse adapter instead we are directly creating an object of mouse adapter new mouse adapter and implementing the method mouse pressed okay the as simple explanation as it can and all that remaining stuff is same now i can run this one mouse pressed it will generate the same output okay but the difference is instead of creating the uh, my mouse adapter class extends mouse adapter we are creating directly an anonymous inner class in this add mouse listener okay what we are create we are creating in the previous example we were creating a separate class okay let's see the difference inner class demo and I will open that one so that you will understand the difference okay so here we created this class class my mouse adapter extends mouse adapter and handle that mouse based event mouse event ME 
okay and the object of this my uh, my mouse adapter is passed here new mouse my mouse adapter in the default constructor of inner class demo but what we are doing over here is we are directly creating add mouse uh, add mouse listener new mouse adapter so directly we are creating the uh, object of my uh, mouse adapter and inside we are handling the mouse based event so no need to write a separate class that extends the mouse adapter so that it will take uh, it will save our time it will save the lines to be written okay and it is as simple as that if you are clearly understanding this the difference between two it is very much greater uh, it is very much great thing because you are saving our your time also and you are saving our your effort also okay so now you can go through this project here also new window adapter is directly added no class is created here we created a class here we created a class my window adapter extends window adapter instead we directly passed add window listener new window adapter and here we handled the method window closing okay and in that we return we have written system dot exit zero this is the paint paint method okay that we may display message at coordinate 20 into 80 and it's the public static void main okay so this way we have understood all the practical examples related to mouse events and key events and also inner class and anonymous anonymous main class demo so in the next next session from the next session onwards we will see more related topics to our java programming more interesting chapters okay so meet you in the next session with a brand new example thank you so much